Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a what's in my bag. If you saw my big collective haul with like TK Maxx, Primark and Boots, you will have seen that I bought a new handbag. I've had the handbag for a couple of weeks. I have no idea what is in here anymore. If you are new to my channel, then make sure to hit the subscribe button down below to see videos from me on a weekly basis. And also make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it. So let's get on with the video. So this is my bag. It is a June bag. I picked it up from TK Maxx. I think it was supposed to be about 60 pounds, like the original price of this but in TK Maxx I had it down to 23. It's a very sturdy and strong bag like it can stand up on its own and keep the shape of it which I really really like. I like strong sturdy bags and for £23 like it's a bargain. It has a really nice texture on it as well which I really like and it just sort of makes it feel a little bit more luxury. It comes with a long strap on it as well and obviously you can take that off if you want to but be really awkward <laughs> as you can see it's pretty jam-packed it is obviously a much smaller handbag but that's exactly what I wanted so it can't fit loads of stuff in but it can kind of fit in my essentials so let's just see what's in here I guarantee there's gonna be about 15 lipsticks probably at the bottom somewhere so first thing on top is obviously my phone this is an iPhone I want to say 6 I don't think it's a 6s case that I have on top of it is just one that I picked up it's a really really inexpensive one but I picked it up on Amazon and it's just like a rubber one that fits and I also just have like a protective screen on the front of it I don't know if it makes much difference I'll be honest but it came free with the phone case so that's that next thing in my bag is these Primark PS love your skin gentle facial Cleansing wipes, I never normally use these. I keep these in my car, but I had my car cleaned yesterday because it was really, really dirty. I took these out of my car and just put them in my bag. But I just keep these in my car normally and they come in a pack of two for a pound. So they're quite good just to have on hand. Next thing is my diary. If I can get it out. This one. This, I've, I've mentioned it on my last two videos I want to say. This is my 2017 diary. Picked it up from Sainsbury's. I really, really like it. I'll go to an empty page so you can just see roughly what it looks like. I really like it. I like that it's sparkly and gold and that's about it. It's a diary. <laughs> then is on to my purse. Now again I picked this up in TK Maxx at a different time to when I picked up the bag. The brand is Ashwood. I have never heard of them before but it is a super super pretty purse and it has a really nice like stag as the logo which I really really like. I wanted a purse that could fit everything in so I picked up this one. I like that it is really flat um, and it has a coin bit on the one side then on the back it has a clip that you can undo. You can obviously store all your cards in there. The only thing that I don't love about this purse it's not it's not like a bad thing about this purse but like that kind of frustrates me about this purse is this when it is closed like so and you want to get to your change you can really easily but if it was all the way open all the change falls down from here to the bottom of this that's the only thing that kind of frustrates me but I suppose you can keep more change in your purse that's a good thing but yeah that is the purse that I picked up and I'm super super happy with that and this was I think it was meant to be like I want to say 39.99 it was around the 40 pound mark originally but I got it for 12.99 so that's that this is where I get to the things that I don't know what they are I then have my car keys and I have a little picture on there and I have a little pom-pom that I like to change to be seasonal when it was summer like spring summer I had a like orangey kind of one on there and now it's winter kind of coming to the end of winter I've gone for grey then I have my house keys which I actually need to put on my car keys but this is quite fragile so I don't think that'll hold on there i've just seen how many lipsticks are in the bottom of this oh earrings we have one earring this is this is one of my favorite earrings to wear um, where did i buy you i think i got it from i want to say asda i bought this key ring uh key ring from hopefully one is in there somewhere oh a pen to go with my diary i have my chanel compact in here which i've had for years and i love it i have dropped this so many times and it is still alive so that is a must-have in my handbag 
Then I have my perfume at the minute, which is one I got for Christmas, and it is Pants by Chanel. Chanel is just my favourite perfume. I absolutely love it. It smells, oopsie, you can see how much I've already used, and I've only been using it for like the last two weeks. And oh, another earring. Then I have, oh, I wore this yesterday. This is the Avon Perfectly Matte Lipstick in the shade Posh Petal. This is one of my favourite all time lipsticks. It's super, super lovely. I uh, wore it yesterday, so that's why it's in my bag. Oh, so many lipsticks on I have MAC, what are you? Cream Sheen Creme Cut. And I don't have much of this left. I just have a little bit of a stub left although actually in the bottom of MAC lipsticks there's actually still quite a bit of product left so if you ever run out of a lipstick make sure to like dig it out dig it out next one is Charlotte Tilbury oh this is Kim KW which Leah got me for Christmas this has been the lipstick that I have worn most days it's just so easy and goes with everything and I absolutely love that so thanks Leah for that one I have another Charlotte Tilbury lipstick this is in the shade bitch perfect which is a lot darker than Kim KW but yeah that's another lovely one I love those kind of like really nude nudes to kind of like the rosier nudes at the moment I'm loving that that's that this one is MAC velvet teddy which I have actually neglected for months so I thought that I would try it out and I went out for a meal the other day so I wore that so that one's that next one is the Laura Mercier lipstick in the shade spiced rose again you can see it's very similar to the other colors that's one two three four five six and there's still more there's still more but that's a really nice lipstick is the last one yes thank the lord this is my highly loved should look after it more but it is my tom ford spanish pink lipstick again you can see there's hardly any of this left but these are the colors that i am obviously loving at the moment so that's also in my handbag i always have is, is anybody else like it do you always have like loads of lipsticks at the bottom there's only a couple of things left but i have two nail glues been loving wearing false nails especially the Primark ones because they're so inexpensive that you can literally just put them on in an evening if you're going out and you don't want to wear them for like a week but I've noticed they last really really well I have a glue that is open and a backup just in case the other one closes up or seals up or glues shut something like that because that always happens then the last thing I think I have in here oh I have a Primark nail it's actually really disgusting and the last thing I have I was looking for this morning is the Soap and Glory Smolder and Coal Eyeliner. This is in the shade, I want to say black is black. I think I just made that up, you know, but there we go. This is a really, really good eyeliner. Super like smoky and nice and I really, really like a dark, dark eyeliner. I feel like when I don't wear eyeliner, I kind of don't feel complete. I don't know if anyone else is the same, but yeah, that's a really, really good one. So that is that. I think that is it. So that is everything that is in my bag. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up so I know that you like this kind of video. And maybe next time when I have a new bag, I will definitely do an updated one. So yeah, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. If you are new to my channel, make sure to subscribe for weekly videos every Sunday at 6pm. And I will see you next week for another video.